Welcome to the Truth Hub. In John chapter 8, verse 32, the scripture reads, You shall know the truth, and the truth will make you free. This is the inspiration behind the Truth Hub, an effort to bring the sincere seeker of the truth, hope and meaning in this world of trouble. Today we want to deal with the issue how to cope with stress. Uh, stress has become a common word in our modern society today with the increased activities uh, that is choking us up on every side. Uh, and so everybody wants to know how to deal with the issue of stress. By the way, you know, uh, we get stressed up when our bodies are unable to cope with the stimulus or challenges, whether it be physical, emotional, or uh, otherwise. And that means that we are already overcome on our own so that we need a help outside of us to deal with the issue of stress. And that is where God comes into the picture. In uh, Matthew chapter 11, verses 28 through 30, God gives us a wonderful invitation. He says, come to me, all you that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. You know, God understands our struggles. God understands that we can get overwhelmed by the challenges of this life. And so he has made a way so we can have a solace in the midst of all the challenges of life. Of course, we need family, we need friends, we need neighbors. Uh, Galatians chapter 6 verse 2 says we should bear one another's body. We need the support of our family and our friends and our neighbors to cope with the issue of stress. But another very important uh, thing that we need in dealing with stress is rest. And you know, God has so uh, designed things that we need weekly rest. In Exodus chapter 20 verses 8 through 11, God said, remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Rest from all your labors. I start, I walked for six days of the week and I rested on the seventh day to show you an example. And if we follow this, I believe our health would significantly be improved. In Mark chapter 6 verse 31, we also find a, an invitation to rest because rest is very crucial. Uh, and above all, to remember and not to forget casting all our cares upon the Lord as we are invited in 1 Peter chapter 5 verse 7. So my dear friend, you can live a stress-free life by recognizing your limit and pushing that which you cannot control to God and your life will be wonderful. And you can also share this message with your friends. God bless you. Have a great time.